Okay, question. How would you love, how would you help people experience this level of love regardless of whether there's another person involved? Okay, this is great. Okay. So honestly, let's just be clear that the healing work that we're talking about that I've done for the last 12 years is not just about preparing myself to love another person, but really deeply falling in love with me. But to answer your question, Wanisha, it's that falling in love with every part of me. I've fallen in love with the onstage, the offstage. I've fallen in love now with the dark places. I like know what they are and I'm not afraid to tell people about them. Right? I mean, we were walking through the mall one day and he said, you know, what's, what's your deep, dark secret? I was like, I don't have any secrets. I think they give you cancer. I'll tell you anything. What you got? Like, <laughs> people can ask me anything. Like, I don't have any secrets, right? Like, that part of, like, just knowing that I don't have anything to hide and that I can be my full self is the love that I've started to give myself in every different area of my life. So I think that's really what I would say. It's the, like, love for self that allows you to say, I can go into a situation that five people around me are telling me might be dangerous and might break my heart, but I know that I'm unbreakable and that if I can open my heart, then it's not there to be broken. It's just there to be transformed, changed, the capacity increased, all those things. So I think that's that's where, I, where it comes from, Juanisha. Thanks for the question. That's a good one.